The author, Lucille Calandro, has written lots of stories about a very interesting character she calls the old lady, and this is the old lady who swallowed a cactus, a type of plant that would be awfully pokey. Uh, so the first question we might be wondering is why she would want to do that. Um, this is spun off of the old lady who swallowed the fly, and she's written lots of stories, uh, primarily based around the holidays. And... I wonder what adventure she's going to have now. What I know about the old lady stories is there's lots of rhyme and repetition. So let's see if we can remember how things go and make predictions about what might come next. Now, there was an old lady who swallowed a cactus. I don't know why she swallowed a cactus, but it took lots of practice. Remember, because it's so pokey. Now, there was an old lady who swallowed some sand from out of her hand. She swallowed that sand. She swallowed the sand to plant the cactus. I don't know why she swallowed a cactus, but it took lots of practice. There was an old lady who swallowed a snake. What a mistake to swallow that snake. Now, she swallowed the snake to hide in the sand. She swallowed the sand to plant the cactus, but I don't know why she swallowed the cactus. But it took lots of practice. Now, there was an old lady who swallowed a coyote. She felt a bit floaty when she swallowed the coyote. <laughs> it doesn't look floaty, but she swallowed the coyote to track the snake. She swallowed the snake to hide in the sand. She swallowed the sand to plant the cactus. But I don't know why she swallowed the cactus, but it took lots of practice. There was an old lady who swallowed suntan lotion. It caused a commotion when she swallowed the lotion. She swallowed the lotion to cover the coyote. She swallowed the coyote to track the snake. She swallowed the snake to hide in the sand. She swallowed the sand to plant the cactus. But I don't know why she swallowed the cactus, but it took lots of practice. Now there was an old lady who swallowed a canteen. Everyone had seen her swallow the canteen. She swallowed the canteen to rinse off the lotion. She swallowed the lotion to cover the coyote. She swallowed the coyote to track the snake. She swallowed the snake to hide in the sand. She swallowed the sand to plant the cactus, but I don't know why she swallowed the cactus. It took lots of practice. Now there was an old lady who swallowed a parasol. Big fancy umbrella. It was the last of her haul. Swallowing the parasol. Now the scorching hot sun. Beating down was the basis. She looks exhausted <laughs> for her to create the perfect oasis. So an oasis is a nice cool spot in the desert. The canteen gives her a little pool. And then we've got the parasol to give her some shade. But do you think it would be perfect for you to be around a coyote with some sharp teeth and a snake that might be venomous? I wonder. Adventures with a cactus for sure. All right, if you're checking this out in Flipgrid or Seesaw for me, I'll have something else for you to extend the lesson.